Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 21st, okay? We are just going to see what comes up. Now, not every reading is for you. My card just fell out, so keep, in, keep that in mind. Not every reading is for you. Um, this is just a reading for whoever it read, the collective, whoever it resonates with. Uh, the timing is fluid. Typically, these tend to resonate. Could be the day of. Could be the day of. Could be a few days. Could be a month. Typically, lately, they've been playing out very quickly. So, let's just see what comes up. The Empress. Interesting. So, the Empress gives birth to a new life, right? This is this is a creator. We have a creator here that is creating a new life. It's a it's an incubation period. There's a new life that is right ahead. It's a time of love, unconditional love. Now the Empress, we all know the Empress is a very motherly type of energy, somebody that is does everything with love. So it is all about love and abundance. So it's definitely a very fertile time. I feel like there's going to be an arrival in the near future. There's, there's going to be some sort of arrival. Woo! Three of Swords. Now, Three of Swords is heartache, pain, suffering, sorrow. So, I'm not sure if we're dealing with a mother that may be experiencing some pain. Because this is a mother. The Empress is a mother. Now, there could be... But that could be because it's in the past. I put it in the past. So, the pain is in the past. But the Empress becomes the Empress through life experience life experience and pain you don't you don't get the blessing you don't get the miracle until you experience pain you don't become the empress until you experience pain but anyhow we have sorrow here this is a mother that maybe that may have maybe this person it doesn't have to be a mother but typically it's a mother this is sorrow it's pain it's heartache it's grieving somebody is is somebody's heart is aching this is heartache Seven of Wands. Now, this is a battle of some sort. Somebody's in a very tough position. Now, there's fighting. There's opposition. There's competition. And we have an individual here that is... Uh, this says Valor, but this is somebody that is a fighter. So, we have a fighter here. We do have a fighter. Oh, we got two. We got the Emperor reverse and the Death reversed. So, this is holding on is getting old. We have somebody that is angry, very, very, very angry, very upset. This is somebody that is corrupt. The Emperor in reverse is somebody that is corrupt. They're angry about something ending. Or they're angry about something. What are they angry about? They're angry about a change that they don't like. There's a change coming and they don't want it to happen. This is clinging to control. We have somebody here that is very, very controlling that doesn't want to give up control. Now, death reverse is a disaster. It's an accident or an incident, you know. I don't know if we're dealing with a father. We could be dealing with a father or a father figure or somebody that is in a position of authority or they think they are in a position of authority. Typically, the emperor in reverse is somebody that is not very experienced, but they may think that they are. You know, this is somebody that deserts you in the, t in the time of need. This is entitled, not experienced, on the wrong side of the law. This is somebody who doesn't take responsibility for their actions. 
And with a death card reversed, it's like there's something that needs to change. But this is like resisting change. We have somebody here that is very, very egotistical. This could be a tyrant, could be a narcissist. Somebody that doesn't want, that is resisting change. We do have somebody here that is resisting change. That is extremely stubborn and egotistical. Not experienced. Hmm. There is going to be some sorrow for this woman. Now, this could be a wife. This could be a husband and wife. It doesn't have to be. Um, we do have a feminine that is going to be experiencing pain if she hasn't experienced it already. There's going to be a battle of some sort. There's going to be a fight. There's going to be some opposition. There could be a near-death experience, okay? In reverse, it could be a near-death experience. It could be a disaster. We, could, we have somebody here that is very controlling, very angry, very narcissistic, that is not qualified, that doesn't accept responsibility. This person may be abusive, unbalanced, um cowardly I'm just I'm trying to get what is going on this is somebody that's abusing their power and they may have lost some of their power so that may be what's going on when people lose their power they get really angry I feel like we have somebody here that's very angry very 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 angry um, and they're not stable if you think about the Emperor reverse this is somebody that is unstable so yeah we have somebody that is unstable and they're and it's like they want to pick a fight. I feel like we have somebody here that is picking a fight. This is somebody that refuses to budge with the Seven of Wands. Likes to fight. Ooh! The Tower. Yes, sir. This is what's going on. There's going to be a major shakeup. Get prepared for a life change. You can't resist it. And the, with the death reversed, somebody has been resisting change. And the universe says, no. No, you can't resist it. You can't resist it. It is time for a change. This is false. It's false. It's not stable. It's not secure. It's not real. You know, it's not built to last. It's It's a false sense of security. So, so it's falseness. It's a false foundation. There's going to be a major shakeup. Get prepared. And it's going to cause some pain. It is going to cause some pain. And I feel like we have a woman that is going to be feeling the pain. And I hate to say that. I really, 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 really do. But I feel like there's somebody in this scenario that is impulsive. This person is impulsive. They like to fight. They like to place blame. They don't want to take responsibility for their actions. And I feel like they're, it's almost like they blow up. This is explosive energy. Things are about to explode. You know, this is like some sort of, I don't know, explosion of some sort. Anyhow, um, this is massive change that is coming that has been resisted. This person is, is, is a lawbreaker. Okay, the emperor reverses somebody that is above the law. They are entitled, right? This is a criminal, right? Very, very controlling. It's a controlling tyrant that is mean, doesn't, doesn't care, doesn't care about his people, you know, not very family oriented. It's all about fighting and winning and being in that position, even though they're not qualified. So there is somebody here that's not qualified for the, for the seat, um, interesting I don't know where those words are coming from anyhow the tower is a massive rude awakening so there is a rude awakening that is coming there's gonna be a change and it's gonna be a painful one this is a painful change Nope. Ah, sun. The sun is a card of enlightenment. It's a card of happiness, bliss, joy, new beginnings, new day, new tomorrow. So there, it, this is from darkness to light. 
So some there's going to be some clarity. There is some sort of enlightenment that is coming after there's you know there's there's some sort of get ready for some fireworks, put it that way. There's going to be fireworks. We have somebody here that is ready to fight. They want to fight. They're going to pick a fight. They're picking a fight and I don't know if it's over a woman or if it's over previous heartache or you know, they're just angry and upset. Somebody is really about ready to to pick a fight. Um, I just, I hear boom. I just heard, I heard boom in my head. So I don't know what that means. But this is light definitely being shed on a situation that is built on false pretenses. Okay, this is a, this is a dismantling. It is a major disturbance. This is a shock. So get prepared for some sort of um, uproar. Okay, there is going to be an uproar. But it needs to happen because it's time to start with a clean slate. This is a necessary evil. So the universe is going to clear something, clear something up. Okay, because happiness, it's all about happiness. It's about a new beginning. This is a breakthrough, actually. I mean, the sun is a breakthrough. So there is going to be a breakthrough, no doubt about it. That leads to happiness. But you must stop resisting the change. Yes, you're going to experience the pain of the shock. This is a shocking pain. Okay, it is. So there's going to be um, a dismantling. Something is going to come crashing down. It is. And everything is going to be seen. This is the birth of a new life as well. So we have the birth of a new life that comes after a major shakeup. Okay, so get prepared. It could be an accident. It could be a fight. Something is going to happen that changes somebody's position because this is a tough position. They're gonna. It feels like they're gonna be knocked out of the position, and I don't know what that means. So um, what is this seven of wands? What is this Seven of Wands? Seven of Wands is caught off guard. Somebody's going to be caught off guard. They're going to be caught off guard by this massive change that is coming. It comes out of nowhere. It feels like it's a disaster because the Tower is a disaster and the Death card is a disaster as well. But the Sun card is a healing light. It's a loving energy and so isn't the Empress. So it's about love. Okay, it's about love, it's about uh, growth, it's a time of growth, and for things to grow, you know, sometimes growth isn't easy, sometimes growth is hard, so this is definitely a time of growth, and I feel like uh, there's going to be a uh, false foundation that is taken down, and I think it's going to be taken down by an individual that is refusing to... Uh, give up you know they're refusing to give up with their stance or whatever um <laughs> judgment reversed now there's karma here judgment is a card of karma and there's lack of truth somebody hasn't been telling the truth we've been talking about this a lot lately judgment reversed is Making a poor judgment calls and not listening to any advice. Breaking the law, you know. So there's somebody is breaking the law and they're going to do something that is against the law by the looks of things. And even if it's the universal law, because the tower is universe and so isn't judgment. Okay, universal law. So I feel like we have somebody here that is breaking the, and that's karma. Karma is universal law, but they could be also be breaking the, you know, earthly law too you know that could certainly be the case but more importantly the universal law now the judgment reversed is poor health it's uh and i do see that health is going to get better 
after this is the after this breakdown okay there's going to be a breakdown something is about to explode or something is about to happen you know and it needs to happen because healing is needed a better life is is here and the only way you're going to get to that better life is to remove yourself from this uh unstable insecure situation that isn't built to last you know it's just something that is is uh temporary it's a temporary situation that isn't serving you anyhow the just the judgment reversed is um moving on from a bad choice there's a need to move on from a bad choice there's a need to come clean but we have somebody here that is so stubborn that they are unwilling to accept responsibility uh, I do feel like there is a lack of acceptance, a lack of acceptance of the truth, blaming others. Some, we got somebody here that is blaming others that is not telling the truth, but the truth is going to be seen. Okay, this is truth being seen very, very, very clearly. There's been some sort of, well, judgment reverse, some sort of lies. They've been hidden quite well, but, but. They aren't going to be hidden for much longer. Get prepared for some sort of uh, delivery of some sort. It's time. It's almost time. It's time for um, the truth to be revealed. So anyhow, or it's time for judgment. It's time for judgment day. It's time for it to be judged. Okay? You will be judged. Okay? Get ready to be judged. Okay? Then maybe the judgment hasn't happened yet. There, there's been a delay. Judgment is about to be happened. Somebody is about to be held accountable for their lies, for their falseness, for whatever it is. They're, they are about to be held accountable by the laws of karma. Okay, it's all about karma right now. And it's about love and it's about unconditional love. And we have somebody here that's obviously very egotistical that can't see that it's all about love. Okay, they can't see that, but they're going to see it because when they get to the point where there's like a near death experience or, you know, there could, I mean, I hate to say it, but, you know, we have death and judgment here, you know, uh, will you be accepted? Will you be accepted at the end? You know, will there be forgiveness? I mean, that's some, that's a, that's a question that you need to, somebody needs to ask, you know, I don't know. Anyway, this is, this is enlightenment. So somebody could be asking for forgiveness. You know, they could end up in a situation where they're begging for forgiveness because, you know, they've made a mistake. And I don't know where the, that's coming from, but I'm just, that's what just came out of my mouth. Anyhow, there's about to be a major disturbance. Life is about to change because it's all about love. It's about love and light. It's not about living in the darkness anymore. So anyway, um, judgment reversed is about being judged subject to trial are you ready are you ready to be questioned somebody may be questioned even for their poor choices they may be put on trial you know they they're, the law could be getting involved here so anyway i feel like there's lack of forgiveness lack of acceptance there's an ending that obviously is needed okay with these three cards we have an ending that is needed it's been delayed it's been delayed because somebody has been refusing to budge they have and it's time for that new life it's time it's time to it's time for unconditional love we have somebody here that is suffering they are suffering, their heart is breaking, or their heart has been broken, or they've been betrayed, or grieving, or something like that. We have, we, it feels like we have a female here. It feels like it's a female, but it could be a, a masculine and a fe feminine energy. We definitely have somebody here that is heartbroken, and it is time. It's time for a blessing. It's time to live. It's time to, you know, be happy. It's time to be happy. And the only way to be happy is to accept the truth and remove yourself from the false sense of security. And if you are refusing to budge and refusing to see the light and refusing to accept the truth and refusing to, you know, get out of that false sense of security, then the universe has to step in and force it. And that, so this is force change that has been resisted. What you resist persists. So we have an angry individual here that is feeling powerless. They're trying, clinging to control. 
And I feel like there, there's health problems here. I feel like there's somebody's health is declining very, very, very fast. And, you know, they may, they may, you know, uh, well, if you think about judgment upright, it's waking up. What is the opposite of judgment, you know, upright? It's not waking up. And we have death right here, you know, so I'm just, I'm just saying, you know, we got somebody here that is refusing to wake up, you know. So, you know, when you refuse to wake up, the universe has to show you the light. They have to show you the way. And it may be the hard way. And I do feel like somebody is going the hard way. And they, they could end up, you know, the courts could get involved even with, with the judgment reverse. There's, but there's definitely been some dishonesty here. We have an individual that is not wanting to lose their position. They're very stubborn, very egotistical. And, you know, they could uh, be taken down somehow. Somebody is about to be taken off their high horse. I mean, that's what I see. It's time to live. It's time to be happy and not stay in places that are unstable and insecure and dark. So yeah, we have somebody here that has been suffering. It's time for that new life. Hanged man. Hanged man. Now the hanged man is a martyr. This is definitely somebody that is very, very, very stubborn. And whoever this person is, they are, they, they are having a hard time doing the right thing. Let's get the hero font reversed. This is somebody that is having a hard time doing the right thing because of social pressure. This is definitely an individual that is not very awakened, not very spiritual, that is very... Um, unawakened yeah we have an unawakened individual that is about to be enlightened okay um they are about to be enlightened they're going to be enlightened the hard way there could be some punishment that is coming the hangman can absolutely be punishment so yeah i feel like we have an individual that has been thinking and analyzing thinking a lot about what their next move should be this person um, has been isolated. They've been sacrificing themselves. Or they, or they may sacrifice themselves to prove a point. So we have the hair font reverse on the bottom. That is, uh, there could be a split. There could be... You know, uh, the end of a marriage, the end of a commitment. Um, we have somebody here that is not very awakened. They're not very spiritual. This is somebody that um, is very controlled by society, which is very, very clear that they're in. And this is disgraced under a lot of social pressure. This is a rule breaker. Okay. This is somebody that does the opposite of what they say. I feel like this person is... I feel like there's karmic punishment coming for this individual. I mean, that's what I feel. I feel like somebody could be found guilty as well. Found guilty for doing something. And I, I don't know. They're guilty. And I feel like it's, I feel like, uh, clarity is coming. It's going to be shown. Whatever they're guilty about is going to be, sh it's going to be shown, you know. Somebody's about to get a new perspective thanks to the universe because the universe is about to show some sort of, I feel like there's, there's punishment coming. I feel like there's karmic punishment, but I was going to say show some, uh, shed some light, shed some light on a situation that is untrue. There's, there's a lack of truth here. And this creates... This because the, the Empress creates a new life. So once this this universe shakes up this foundation, and it is gonna be a major shake up because we have a lot of majors here. Okay? The majority of these cards are major, so this is universally driven. 
okay most of these cards universe 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 what two cards aren't so the universe is in control this is out of our human hands okay the universe is driving a change that has been resisted it's time to wake up good luck